Today, we're getting a haircut. my brain. We are going to be cutting bangs. Not just any bangs, we need a bit of fringe as well because I've established that my forehead is big. I still have a very insecure forehead moment. I'm going to cover that shit up. So I'm going to use my phone and follow a tutorial on TikTok. Okay, so first of all, we have to make a triangle of your hair. Hey guys, so it's editing day right now and basically I started cutting my hair and I was doing bangs at first. I haven't actually cut like the, the main, main part of my hair. hair, but yeah, I have a lot of like fast bits. So I'm probably going to come in at random points and just chat absolute shit. First of all, I'm going to talk about that Amber Heard versus Johnny Depp case because I have been watching that shit on rep. Heat. It is so beefy and so juicy. Like honestly, I am obsessed. Okay, I'm like not speaking because I'm concentrating so much. So I've separated the hair. Pretty sure the next step is to like, and then they twisted it. So should I cut out this here? Also, I am using toner scissors because I don't have any proper like hair cutting scissors. Also, I have school tomorrow. Like I am midweek. This is a Wednesday. May I? This is a Wednesday. Okay. Okay. It's not bad. They comb it out and then they like cut the middle bit. You know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna do what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have my spur of creativity. I'm just gonna cut it how I wanna cut it because it's my hair. Yeah. And I'm gonna yeah. To be honest, with the Johnny Depp and Maherd stuff, I'm trying to keep it impartial because I do think that they generally were toxic to each other. I don't really know. So let me know what you guys think. So I think it'll be really interesting to get everyone's point of view on it. Obviously, it's more of like a serious thing. So, you know, be respectful and stuff. I think it was really big. And especially a lot of the stuff she was saying, I was like, okay, that makes sense. I think it's quite hard, really. If anyone in the comments says it's bad, I know. I'm cutting it myself. Second of all, I would like to talk about the fact that I have done two GCSEs already. I've done biology and tomorrow I have English lit as well stressful and very scary but i also feel good because i feel like the exam aren't even that difficult like i feel like i'm getting through them all and i feel very productive and very happy about that because gcse's are so stressful for like no reason okay, jokely, as they would say in Ned film. Okay, well i say no reason but we all know the real reason it's because it's a fucking gcse and if you fail you have to retake it I'm not trying to put any pressure on anyone but i'm also kind of scared a little bit but it should be fine. Also, guys, I started my H2O recap. I started officially filming and editing it. So that's going to be up soon. I started season one, episode one, and season one, episode two, as well as doing a little summary at the beginning. Anyway, well, that's the way. Anyway, enough with the little jibber jab. Now I'm gonna actually gonna be talking about how I cut my fringe. First of all, I twisted the piece at the front and then I just went across with the scissors and chopped it off just to get the right length that I wanted to. Then I spread it out and I actually cut upwards and then I cut more of a gradient, like straight to the side. Okay, girly. <gasps> I'm gonna do these a bit more like gradient style. Now here I'm like adding more of gradient pieces, like a little bit more going down to the side and just adding a bit more like definition so I frame my face. Now I have actually cut it a bit more so I have more of a fringe, but I actually really like it. And I also got glasses and stuff, but like, you know, basically the end because that's when it's all dry and you guys will see the finished look and I hope you guys do enjoy it because I really liked it. And if you want more videos like this, then let me know. I'm also dyeing my hair soon, so I hope the dye, the hair dye vid, vid comes out soon. Whoa, whoa. They have, I like. I know that I didn't speak much. Hopefully, editing Jay has voice over a bit there. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. But before we finish, you know, before we do the cheeky little outro, it's time to reveal the hair. Me editing vibes. This is like the final reveal with the fringe because it was mainly just the fringe that was cut, none of the other hair, which is why it's a mess. But I'm going to give you guys an honest review. I had to cut a bit more of the fringe just because it was very like, it wasn't giving much. It still isn't giving much, but it's giving a bit more. It's giving me a bit Britney, Britney. A bit of that girl from tending to hair I just wanted to say before I go, if you guys are feeling uncomfortable, dye your hair, get a fucking haircut, hair grows. We all feel so much more confident. I felt so much more confident. Now. Obviously, they look ugly now, but like, I I will feel a lot more confident. So it's the thought that counts. And remember that. Bye.